Hi guys, how you doing? Oh, hope you guys are uh, having a good, uh, a good day, night, evening, whenever you, whenever you guys tune into this. You might have seen as I as I walked in, got a nice, uh, got a nice little box here, <laughs> and uh, that uh, that will be this will this will be this will be pretty cool. I've seen a few people unbox this uh, unbox this lately, so it'll be kind of uh, it'll be kind of cool how to you know it'll be be kind of be kind of cool how to uh, uh, you know seeing it you know up close and in person. I've seen pictures of it, hadn't actually seen it in person, so uh, I'll get a chance to actually see it in person. Speaking of, let me get get that just in case or just. Just in case. Hello. That's what I'm going to be using to open the box. But, uh, I, uh, I hope you guys are, uh, having a, uh, a good one. And, uh, you'll probably see, and I've got another one, I think. I think it's supposed, to, it's supposed to come this next week sometime. I'm not sure exactly when, but, uh. It's a jersey I ordered probably, oh, what was it? Probably mid, mid January from a place I had never actually ordered from. It will be absolutely killer when it gets here. I think, I think you guys will definitely like it because I know I'm going to like it and that, uh, that will be uh, pretty, pretty, pretty neat. So, uh. I, uh, I'd like to uh, welcome you guys, and uh, you know if there's anyone new that's just strolling on through, I'd like to say welcome, and uh, you know hopefully you'll uh, you'll like the video, and if you like it, don't be afraid to hit that like button, and if you really like it, hit that subscribe button. I would greatly appreciate it, and I would love to have you be a part of the channel. So, with that out of the way, what do you see? Or what do you what do you see? What do you see? Hey, look at that. What do you see? You see a box. <laughs> what do you say? What do you, there you go. What do you say? We, uh, we kind of tapped into this bad boy. I got this, by the way, from uh, SportsK, SportsK.com. Great site. Absolutely great site. And, uh, let's see, where is the... And I think I'm like I'm like where's the where where's the part part you open this at? So what do you say we uh, we crack this bad boy open and uh, get a good look at this thing? And there's that. Okay, I suppose we gotta do it right here. Do it along the do it along the edge there, cause sometimes you just gotta do that. Because they definitely they don't mess around with their uh, with the way they with the way they do this they tape they tape it up they tape it up they make it look nice and uh, yeah you can't really beat it all right so what do you say we uh, we crack this bad boy open and uh, you guys will get a good look at uh, a good look at what's in this thing what's in here. So one thing, Sports K definitely they don't mess around with their boxes. They their boxes are pretty darn good. So I'm gonna give you guys a little uh, little show here in case you guys want to guess. You guys got any guesses of uh, what this uh, what this bad boy could be? If you want to if you want to take a guess, let me know in the comment section what you guys' guess is. I'll give you a little, uh, little, little, little hint, little uh, look. See, so if you guys can see that there. If, uh, if you've got any guesses, let me know in the comment section. Let us see what we have here. Oh. <laughs> I even got a little, uh, 
even got a little uh, little little something extra. Every now and then, Sports K does that. Is there anything else in here? No, I think they threw in a a Winter Classic patch from 2018. Oddly enough, I think I have one. I think I have another one of these somewhere from this particular year. That's pretty cool, though. Not bad. So, what do you say? We, uh, we give this a look-see here. Wow. Oh, that's nice. That's very nice. Very, very nice. And let's move this, move this box out of the way here. So we can crack this bad boy open in case uh in case you guys maybe i don't know if you guys got a glimpse of it already but but uh let me say we love that sound it's just something about that sound that just you know everybody you know we we all we all kind of like and uh Alright, put that down there. Of course, got the wrapping. And, so, there, hang on a sec. Let me get the, there you go, get the bag out of the way. Alright, so, let us get a look see at this and show you guys. In case uh, you know you guys got your guesses in, and uh, this is the first one of these that I have that I've gotten now. It is the Team Classic 1979 Quebec Nordiques. That is cool. Now the material is a little different. It's a little different than than the CCM. It is. It is a more lighter weight material than the uh, than the CCM. The collar obviously is a little a little different. The Florida Lees are nice though. These are oh those are those are really nice. They're sewn on, as you can probably see. They're you know they're sewn they're sewn onto the jersey. They're also they're sewn on down here too. You can probably see right there. That's nice. That's really, really nice. That's that's killer. And of course, here's the. Now I ordered this in a sixty, because normally I get the Adidas in a sixty. So I wanted to get one of these in a sixty because they said these are a very similar cut to the old CCMs. Where the old CCMs, I wear I wear a uh, a two XL, and it fits really nice. So I wanted to try a sixty at first to see exactly how it fits, and uh, to see if if I actually will need to go down a size. We'll see. But uh, but in here, obviously, you've got. You know, it says, uh, you know, the Team Classics right there. Quebec Nordiques logo, 1979. From their from the first year they came in to the uh, to the NHL from uh, the WHA. And it's interesting, the logo they had. It's, I mean, it's, you know, the, the puck is off, the, the puck is totally kind of off where the, where, where we all know that the puck normally would be, I like I like the color though. I like the white. I like the white uh, the white igloo there, with the the red and the blue around there. That's that's a really nice touch, and that's a nice logo. That's a really nice logo. So and yeah, it looks it looks like it's you know it looks like it's a pretty decent sized jersey. So let us do some people like do some people like the uh you know leaving the tags on. I'm not a fan of that. 
Ow! As I damn near, as I damn near cut myself. Damn it. Ah, there we go. Yeah, I'm not, I, I've never been really much of a fan of, of, uh, you know, leaving the tags on. I know, a lot, I know some, some people like to wear, like to have the tags left on. Because, I mean, they might sometimes, you know, they might sometimes sell them. So they, you know, they want to make sure and they want to leave the tag on. Where, to me, eh, don't really want to leave the tag on. Well, there's a little, oh, little, uh, little straggler there. <laughs> Just a little straggler there. But, uh, let's check the born on date here. Here's the born on date. The born on date is... October of 21. So this was made in October. I like the I, I like the I like the little tags in there. I do like the I do like the little the little tags there. That's pretty cool. That is that one especially. I like that. That is a really really cool cool little little thing. And yeah, and down here at the bottom, there's the Adidas logo. Now, there are a few other, because they came out with six. They came out with six teams to kind of start. There, I wish they'd come out with a few more. One in particular that I would love to see come out in the Team, in the team Classic Series, the Fisherman jersey from the New York Islanders. That would look fantastic. In one of these, the fisherman? Yeah. Well, what do you say we uh, we try this we try this on, and uh, we'll see just how big this thing is. Cause if it's if it's monstrous, I might have to get fifty. I might have to get a fifty-six. Let's see here. Oh wow! Oh Jesus! Oh, holy crap. Okay. Wow. <laughs> look at the wings. Look at the wingspan on this thing. Yeah, I might need a 56. This thing is huge. Huge. Holy cow. Look at that. Look at that in the, the neckline there. That looks cool. I mean, look, <laughs> look at this. Look. Holy crap! <laughs> That's insane. Well, you know, jeez. Yeah, I think I need. A, I think I think in I think in these ones I need a fifty-six. Cause this is yeah, this is this is huge. Absolutely huge. Yeah, this is holy cow. Yeah, that's 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 nuts. Now the now the material is a little more lightweight. This is not the. Uh, I mean, it's kind of the. It's it's got a very similar look to the CCM vintage ones because it is this. I don't know if you can really see here, but uh, it's it's this Airnet. It's an Airnet polyester. Now, <clears throat> I'll do that after after I give the close up here, but uh, but yeah, this thing's wow, that thing's big. Yeah, I definitely might need. I definitely think I'm going to need a uh, a 56 in this. But uh, what do you say? We uh, we give you guys a little uh, a little look see here. Nice little close up. All right. Now this, of course, this is the this is the uh, the vin the vintage style old school type neckline. Now, of course, there you get the you know there's a little close up of the of the material there going across the front. There, of course, there's the there's the fleur de lis. Very nice, very very nice how they did that. And of course, go down the sleeve, as you can tell, backing up there. <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> oh, that's insane! That that's nuts! <laughs> that's insane! 
it's 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 kind of funny but uh you know let's keep keep going down here let's get a good look at the logo here look at that look at the the material the the way they did the logo that's fantastic really really nice go down in the igloo there keep going down look at the the stitching there i mean that's just that's that's really really nice you know of course you got the go into the stick here the stick of course this was being this was the 1979 version they they had the stick a little you know they had they had a little separation there and of course the puck is you know over there kind of interesting how they how they how they how they did that but that was how they had it in 1979 and you keep going down into the blue go down here's the here's the other floor to lee down there one of three three on the there's three i think on the front one two and three yep three on the front and there's three also in the back you go down and then you go into the white right there at the bottom go and shoot back up another nice close-up shot of the logo there i mean that's that's fantastic that is something that is something else very very cool definitely uh yeah i like it i do de i definitely like it i think though i'm i'm gonna need a 56 in these i'm pr i mean i mean with with help i mean it's i mean this this thing's big it's big <laughs> it is big now i mean i like bigger i like bigger jerseys i do i like bigger stuff because it is it's uh uh you know because it's you know bigger bigger guys we have we like bigger clothes so what i figure i would do here because as you can see this is the 1979 version this here is the is the nordiques jersey that we all are familiar with this is the style that they had throughout the throughout the 80s and everything of course the florida the, the they're not they're not sewn on here they're just heat pressed on same with the logo here but uh you know as i kind of you know I kind of try to back up a little bit. Should raise my desk a little bit here. Get a little or lower it. One of the two. Yeah, that might be a little better. Ah, oh, there we go. Yeah, if you guys saw one of my last videos, you know, I got a nice adjustable desk. Oh, fantastic. But uh but yeah, here's kind of the comparison, the side by side. Now the material like I said, this material here is a little more lightweight than this. Because this, this one, come on, this is Canadian made. The material is Canadian made. This is Indonesian made. So it is a different, it is a, it is a different feel. This is more lightweight than this one. But it's basically the same type of material. I mean, there's, you know, you can kind of see the, uh, you can see that right there. And the, the, uh, the cuff here on this is a lot longer. It's a lot longer, wider than the cut here. But it is pretty, it is very similar material. Very similar material. So, but the main reason why the material, why this is so much lighter, this is Indonesian made. This is Canadian made. And I think I, I like both of them. I think they both, they both look really nice in their own way. I, I kind I like, I like how they did this. The white, the white igloo. I mean, that's, I mean, that's cool. That is really cool with the, uh. You know the red outline here, where on this one the igloo is red, with the uh, with the blue around. I mean, you still got the blue around here, but I mean, there's the you know there's I mean there's obviously the subtle differences, but uh, I think they I think they both 
I like them both. I think they both are really cool. I'd love to hear your guys' thoughts. Which one do you like better? You like the you like the style that they had from the 80s into the 90s? Or you like their version from 1979? To me, I think they're both great. I'd love to hear your guys' thoughts on that though. What do you guys think of of that? Do you do you like the do you like the the 1979 one? Or do you like the uh, the eighties and nineties version? It would be uh, be awesome to hear you guys' thoughts on that. But uh, yeah, this is this is pretty cool. <sighs> Sorry guys, get a little drink of water there. But uh, but yeah, I wanted to get this in a sixty because I wanted to see just how big it was. And because uh, Ben from Ben H Sports, he just got his stock in. And he was doing, I mean, he had tape measure, he had tape measures, he was doing all the, he was getting all the stuff uh, situated there. But, uh, yeah, I'm thinking I might need, I, you know, because, I mean, I normally wear 60, I normally wear 60s in the Adidas jerseys. The CCMs, I wear a 2XL, which, 2XL is like a 56. So I'm thinking, I, so I'm thinking when it comes to these... I'm thinking I might need a 56. I definitely at least will probably get one in a 56. And then I will try and compare. I'll try to compare the, you know, the 56 and the 60 and see which one fits better. I think the 56 will fit. I think the 56 will fit a lot like this one does. Because this is, this is a, this is a 2XL. As I think, you know, I think, I think you guys saw the, I think you guys saw the size there. Come on, you bastard. There we go. So, so yeah, this is a 2XL. 2XL, vintage, vintage CCM, made in Canada. And so that's, that's the big difference in, in the material. The material is, it's, it's, it's still the Airnet polyester. But that's Canadian made. This is Indonesian made. So it is it is a lot lighter. And this actually, I mean, this is not it's not bad. I mean, I don't I definitely don't mind it. I love the way they did the Florida Lees. It's all sewn on there. It's very, very nice. And I mean, you know. Let's give a look see at how the how it's sewn on in here. That's very nice. Very, very cool. I definitely like it. So, what are you guys' thoughts? You know, do you guys like you guys like this one? Do, do a lot of you plan on getting them? I know I've seen a couple of people unbox them. I think uh, I think the enforcers unboxed one un, unboxed this one. Um, oh, who is it? I think Shaman the hockey guy. I think he's un, he's unboxed this one. And uh, who else? Oh, BA from BA Sports. He's unboxed this one. And uh, yeah, I plan on, I plan on getting a, a couple more of these. But I know if, I know I'll get I will probably I'll at least get one in a fifty six where I can try the fifty six on and see the you know the difference. You know, definitely the difference in size and just you know how much smaller the the 56 would be and if the 56 will fit me like the 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 double XL in the the CCM in the old CCM style. So I uh that should uh, that will probably do it for me. I thank you guys for uh for being here. Hopefully you were able to make it all the way through to the end of the video if you were able to. Thank you so much. And uh again, let me know let me know in the comment section. You guys like this? I think it's I think it's pretty cool. And do you plan on do you plan on jumping on some of these team classic ones? I know I I know I'm there's a few more of them that I'm that I definitely plan on jumping on and I hope that they make some more. One in particular, the Fisherman. Would love to see the Islanders Fisherman in a in a team classic. I think that would be fantastic. 
So I thank you again for, uh, I thank you guys again for being here. Uh, hit, uh, you know, don't be afraid to hit, uh, hit that like button. If you like the video, if you, you know, hit the, hit the subscribe button. If you really like it, I would love to have you be, be a part of the channel and go through this journey with me. And, uh, you know, again, and if you're, if you're new, I love talking hockey. I love unboxing jerseys and, uh, yeah, I mean, anything hockey related, I love talking about and it's, it's just, it's, it's a lot of fun and, and yeah, hopefully next week I will be unboxing another one that should be coming. That's, uh, that I've been waiting on for a little while and, uh, I'm pretty sure it's going to look fantastic. So, uh, I, again, I thank you guys for being here. Hit like and subscribe. If you're just, you know, roaming on through, you and you know, if you come across the video, hopefully you like it. Hit the like button. Hit that subscribe button. I would uh, greatly appreciate it, and would love to have you be here up as uh, as a part of the channel, and uh, you know, enjoy you know the unboxings and just the jersey talk and just general hockey talk. So uh, again, thank you guys for being here. Hit that hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. I'd love to I'd love to see you here, and uh, I will talk to you guys again very soon.